Hi, I'm Paul Nicholson, Director of Product Marketing at A10 Networks. Welcome. Uh, what was the main message of your presentation today? So today it was talking about how the IPv6 solutions we have and also IPv4 preservation solutions can benefit enterprise networks. Excellent, excellent. What advice do you have for future IPv6 professionals? So really, with IPv6 being so new, some people are, s are still scared of it and working out what they can actually you know, do with it, and uh, they're very used to IPv4. So really, with the IPv6, what w the main advice would uh, give is to get your feet wet, to basically start using it. By using it, it takes away some of that fear, and then also you're going to have some business benefits such as allowing universal connectivity for all users on the internet, whether they're coming in on IPv6, which is growing, or coming in on IPv4. Excellent, excellent. What are some of the most important takeaways from your presentation today? So really, I try to use a lot of customer examples in terms of um, you know, why people did certain things with certain technologies. So some of the biggest takeaways are to plan early, start using it. There might not necessarily be a business reason today, but you want to start using it before it becomes critical and it will cost you a lot more money to hire expensive consultants to come in and try and fix something for you. And especially if you have custom applications, you may want to start planning early to make sure everything which works on IPv4 also works on IPv6. Uh, the other thing is there's many different solutions out there. So I talked about various different technologies such as 6RD which allows access. Uh, to uh, IPv6 from an IPv4 core network. There's also DSLi, which typically does the opposite. There's NAT64, DNS64, which uh, allows IPv6 only clients to ac access IPv4 websites, and translating it back to them on IPv6. Each one of the solutions does a different thing. So really it's trying to work out what you need to do, what the business problem you're trying to solve is, uh, and then uh, choosing the right solution. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you.